when you walk through the door, there needs to be a shift in your mind. Every single time we go into a gym, we're also mentally training ourselves. It's not, you know, going to the gym and, and doing a hundred sets of squats and expecting that to, to give you the results that you're after. It, it, you know, it takes consistency, it takes sacrifice, it takes discipline. It's the mentality and the mindset when you're in the gym and you know, you've got that bar on your back and you're on the seventh rep of your last set. You've got three more to go and you don't think you can make it. What do you do? Do you get scared and rack the bar? Or do you take a deep breath, you plant your heels in the ground and believe that you can make it happen? It's the same thing for anything else in life. It's about waking up every single day and embracing the struggles, embracing the grind, embracing the opportunity for what it is. That's an opportunity for you to step up and not, not just show everybody else what you're made of, but prove it to, to, to yourself. So if you say, I've got five sets of 10, don't you dare skip out at four because you're cheating yourself. You can see the people that are pretenders. Not checking my phone a little bit. All of my focus is right there. Go all in. If you're gonna do something, if you're gonna show up, go all in. You can't fake all in. You know whether or not you went to the wall. Today is today. Let me, let me do the best that I can do today. I killed it today. And that's hard, man. Go all in. I'm going all in. I know. I know I took it to the wall. I leave that gym, I'm feeling pretty close to bulletproof, you know, because I know I paid the price to be my greatest. You can leave the field of battle knowing that you put your best out there. We have that ability, as, as strong as our minds are, we have the ability to convince ourselves of anything.